Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Danielle and today we're going to do a quick grocery haul. So here I have about $50 worth of groceries from Aldi. So I want to show you guys what $50 will get you at Aldi. So let's go ahead and jump into it. The first thing I have is a bag of mild cheddar cheese. This is going to be used for, I'm not quite sure what. We can use this for loaded baked potatoes. We can use it for macaroni and cheese. Then we have some biscuits. I got two of these. I like to make breakfast sandwiches with these. They're really good for that. So I went ahead and got two cans of these, or my husband did. I sent him to the store, and he was so gracious as to go after work. I know he's tired, but he still went, so thank you for that. Then we got some spaghetti, and they sell theirs in like two pound boxes, I think. Yep, two pounds, and it's only like a dollar, so. Yeah, then we got some cinnamon. I ran out today. So there we go. One little container of cinnamon. And then a bottle of teriyaki sauce. I'm gonna use this for um, making some teriyaki pork chops. And that should be really good. Along with some white rice. Also got some grape jelly. I prefer jam, but they don't sell grape jam at Aldi, at least not in this size container. My kids go through this stuff so fast and they don't really care. So if I don't feel like going to like Target or somewhere else, I'll get the jelly as opposed to the Welch's grape jam. Next we have some chicken nuggets. And I really like their brand of chicken nuggets. They did change them for a minute and they were disgusting when they did that, but they put it back. So now I really like them. I liked them before and I like them now because they put it back in the bag. This is what the bag looks like for the good ones. If it looks anything, if it looks like anything other than this, then it's not the right one. But hopefully by now they phased the other one out of all the stores. Also got two um, pounds of ground turkey. I'll probably use this for some spaghetti or something for dinner. If you guys are interested in knowing what I'm cooking for dinner, then definitely check out my What's For Dinner videos. I just started filming one this week, so it should be coming within the next few days. And I've also created a separate playlist just for that. So there's the two things of turkey. Also got one roll of sausage. This is good for um, putting on pizza as a topping or either I like to make breakfast sandwiches with this. So I'll take um, a sausage patty and the biscuits and make a breakfast sandwich with some American cheese. Here are those pork chops for um, the teriyaki pork chops I'm planning on making. I like to have the assorted pork chops that have the bone in. I prefer not to have them thinly sliced, but that's all they had, so he, he grabbed that. And then they had these um, chicken drumsticks on sale for 79 cents a pound, so he grabbed two. I asked him to grab two um, family-sized containers of these because I'm going to be making some fried chicken with this because I just have the biggest craving for fried chicken, and this is my favorite piece to eat when it comes to fried chicken. It's actually my favorite piece of chicken, period for like just cooking to eat off the bone. Not a grocery item, but we got some baby wipes because we were running out. And he got a ton of bananas. I like to buy them green. I don't like my bananas super ripe. So there are two bunches of bananas. These will be, for me, an eating condition within like a day. <laughs> I like them when they're just just turning yellow. Then we got one container of whole milk. My youngest son loves whole milk for some reason these days. He doesn't want the 2% and then we got 2% for everybody else for cereal and stuff like that. Um, we also have almond milk in here so I didn't grab that. And then the last thing is two containers of eggs. So this is my entire grocery haul. Let me move the bags so it doesn't look so junky. So this is my entire grocery haul. This is what $50 gets you at Aldi. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.